All right, welcome back guys. My name is D and today we're gonna do a sniper skill build for Ragnarok Online. So for high archers or archers in general, you want to do um, Owl I3. Um, get your range. So Vultures I10 and then go into double strafe. And then improve concentration. Finish off Owl's Eye for the Dex, and then remaining stats goes into Arrow Shower. So once you hit Sniper, um, I would recommend um, getting the Bird skills first. Um, so you need one Beast Bane to unlock Falcon Mastery. Get that. Uh, get your Bullet Speed and max out Steel Crow. So you pretty much have your auto blitz right here, then you can actually uh, get Falcon Assault, True Sight, and Sharp Shooting. So those are, will be your main damaging skills. So after that, you can pretty much get like Wind Walk, Maxed Out, Skid Trap, uh, Ankle Snare just to lock the to lock your opponents down you can either set this up in advance or push this towards them using arrow shower and um, you can do like a shockwave trap if you're into PvP but I generally want to go sandman for the sleep so after that um, I go detecting four and get to remove trap i need one landmine remove trap and then so you basically have four more points to use um uh, you can just put this on spring trap honestly if you will or you can put this on like skid trap this is mainly a skill just to push you forward if someone is like uh, trying to catch you you can use that instead but I generally just want to put it in like um, spring trap since I will usually. So yeah, this is the Agi Deck Sniper, good for leveling or woe depends on. Well, not woe, PVP actually. So yeah, let's try um, a trapper build. So for sniper trappers, uh, if you don't know, uh, they usually go like medium decks and then a lot of int into like some vit too. So the reason for that is landmine, falcon assault are all based off of your int stat. So uh, once you hit sniper, I would recommend getting um, the bird skills first like normal. Uh, blitz speed, max out steel crow, and then get uh, falcon assault. So you don't really need true sight or um, sharp shooting. These are uh, basically damage increasing skills. Normally for trappers in PvP or WoW, uh, they don't really use um, um, double strafe. They they're more towards like um, locking you down, setting up. Uh, landmine stacks and then pushing it towards you uh, and killing you in one shot they can do like three three stacks three uh, uh four stacks and then just push a landmine towards you since they have high int that landmine is going to do a lot of damage okay so after that i would recommend just getting wind walk just for the additional move speed right off the bat and then going into your um, trap skill tree. So of course you want to get um, landmine maxed out. You want remove trap, ankle stare of course. Um, shockwave trap is very situational. I don't usually get this because people can just use SP pots, but it depends on you. Um, one one thing you want would be Sandman, just for um, uh, characters that can actually be slept, 
and then just one point in freezing trap after that you can just uh, max out skid trap and then uh, get detecting four and after this it really depends on what you want uh, you can even get true sight if you really want to like double strafe which could be a good idea because you don't really have anything else that you want to get unless you want to put points in shockwave trap so that could be a good option but for this since it's pvp um i'd rather get spring trap honestly and then get that shockwave trap just in case so with spring trap uh you can actually plant like a lot of like um sad man traps or um freezing traps like around pvp and if anyone gets close since it's invisible you can just trigger the trap right there get them slept and then stack your landmines push him push them towards it and they're pretty much dead so yeah another variation like i mentioned you can just get true sight if you don't want shockwave and spring trap depends on you so yeah, that's the skill build right there. Let me know what you think. Put it in the comment section below and let me know what other skill builds that you want me to make. Uh, it can be like any class or any like any like random build that you want me to make. Just put it in the comment section below. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, see you guys in the next one.